Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Anastas. In today's video, I'm going to be opening a Kwanzaa F Elite Trainer box and the Reggie Lecky V Collection box and Reggie Drago V Collection box. These are the first two products that I've released in the Kwanzaa F expansion. So without further ado, let's get it. All right, guys. So first up, we have the Kwanzaa F Reggie Lecky V Collection box. Here's the front. Sides back, build a force field of lightning with Reggie E. Lucky V. Here's the Reggie Drago V. And here's the back, fire up a draconic laser beam with Reggie Drago V. And here is the Elite Trainer Box. Is the contents, I'll leave that on screen for a second. There you go. Alright, let me crack these open and show you the contents. Alright, so first up guys, this is your code card. Here's the Reggie Drago Holo promo. Well, it's not a promo, it's technically a reprint. Or a new holo form of the Reggie, Reggie Drago from the Home Skies. I believe it is. Here is the Reggie E. Lucky V. And the Reggie E. Lucky V Jumbo card. And you get four packs in the collection box. So one, two, three, four. Your cold card for the Reggie Drago V. Here's your Cosmo Hollow of the Reggie Lucky V from Dolphins Guys as well. And here's your Reggie Drago V promo card. Your Reggie Drago V jumbo card. And also four packs. Here is the inside of the sleeve, no artwork, just some crown symbols and the top there is blue and then the pinkish red. Here's your player's guide, I have done an opening already on the channel with the Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box Pluses with a more detailed guide of the player's guide, so this one I'll just give a quick overview. Here are some of the cards. go all right guys so straight off the bat the difference between the pokemon center elite trainer box plus and the regular retail elite trainer box plus the actual inside box is different let me just show you as you can see the elite trainer box plus has the black and gold coloring whereas the regular one has on the front the pink kind of um, dash across and then on the back of things blue yep blue there you go and then on the inside of the Pokemon Center one slightly differently patterned and then you get the Pokemon the Pokemon trading card logo and the Crown Zenith logo as well etched in there you go that's the differences here are your regular retail sleeves oh it looks different to the Pokemon Center one which is a look at the Comparison between the two Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box Plus and then the regular one. Here's your Elite Trainer Box Cold Card. Here are the deck dividers for the regular Elite Trainer Box. So one side is blue, one side is pink, magenta, I guess the color is, I think. And here are the differences between the two. Oh, the Pokemon Center one's slightly bigger, I think. And there's the back of the Pokemon Center one. V Star Marker. Condition markers, the dice and damage counters. In a Pokemon Center one, you get metal for each one, so metal dice or damage counters, should I say? Metal condition markers and a regular V star marker. And then you also get a Lucario coin as well. And here is your Lucario restart promo card. And what should be 10 packs 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. Alright, guys, so starting from left to right, we've got one of the collection boxes. This one's the Reggie Lucky, Reggie Yoko V, and here's the Elite Trainer Box. Let's start with the Reggie Lucky. So, four packs from the Reggie Lucky. So, as we get started, guys, I've done a Pokemon Center Elite Trainer Box plus opening times three, so 36 packs. You get 12. High five. High five. Okay. 
Pokemon Center each number of cards, you get 12 packs in the box. So that's 36, so technically a booster box worth. Oh, nice. First pack manager, we get a Pugiana, which is a double for me though. And a Calyrex Hollow. Alright, so not bad, not bad guys. First pack kind of magic, although it's a double for me. I do get an uh, Valerian Gallery from this collection box. Usually collection boxes aren't that great for me. I usually don't get anything from them, so I mean, I guess the Valerian Gallery is not too bad. I just messed up. You idiot! I just messed up. You idiot! So there's a Holo. We start a vacuum. Will we get something in the Galarian Gallery slot? Oh, no, if there's anything special, we're lost. Nope, it's rude. Reverse order. Step back again. Yeah, I've done a. Done a booster box worth of Pokemon Center trainer boxes. And that video was fire, guys. So if you want to watch that, high five. Link in the description down below. That video was fire. That video was fire. The pause on that, I'm happy with it. As always. Oh, nice. That's a new Galarian Gallery for me, Bidoof. And we have a green and V, nice double banger. Last pack from the Reggie Lucky Box. What is anything special? This is not too bad. A V and two Galarian Galleries, nice. If we get anything from this, then. We'll get 4 out of 4 hits. Apart from the V-Star, we've had 3 high fives. Wow. Incurchin, Carrier, Bishop. Yeah, my luck with the Pokemon Sunders, guys. Amazing, amazing. Link in the description down below if you want to check it out again. I appreciate if you do. And oh my days. We've got a special artwork. Wow. Okay. Let's go! I can't have been a Pokemon. I'm happy with that. I need it for the collection, but we've got a Rayhan. Larian Gallery full art and a Willlord. Okay, so not bad for first collection box, guys. We got a full art, a V, and two gets open. And two um Larian Galleries, nice, nice, nice. Three of which I need, one is a double, psychic energy. Not too bad, not too bad. Will this one hold up? I doubt it will. Double toy, meow, young goose, and a Duralodon V, that's a double up as well. Second pack in. So, first pack magic from this box as well. Kind of. We got a V, but still a full. So 4 out of 4 on the first box. We'll be at 4 out of 4 on the second box. Psychic energy again. Wow, what the? Chocolate. Luxio, Friends and Hisui. Goldfish. Oddish. Seal. Pugatot. Aaron. Nope. Nope. Alright, so the only way this Reggie Dragon V box can come back is if we get a double banger, which I doubt we will. Or even if the last pack has anything, the last pack might not even have anything either. But I think we'd have to get a double banger in this one. If not, a banger. And then a double angle in the last pack. Is that what we're gonna get? Pokeball, Crawfish, nope, and nope. Alright, so last pack from the Reggie Dragon V. So this box is disappointing. If I bought this box just alone, it would be very disappointing as an opening. Just pulling a Dreladon V. Yeah, that would be very disappointing. High five. Laron, and then Sinnoh, Bloom, Tangela, Bartoy, Meow, Wilma. Jinx, it do nothing. Well, Alright guys, so one box was not too bad, the second box was bad. But if you're enjoying this video up to this far so far, I'd appreciate if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more. So we get into our elite trainer box. Will we get any better? Alright guys, elite trainer box time. This one should yield a better result, hopefully. Ten packs. But elite trainer boxes are hit and misses. Sometimes you get good, sometimes you don't. I mean, I've seen Psychic Energy. A few good ones and then a few bad ones. Will I end up getting the bad batch? Knowing my luck, yes, probably. 
Sunken. Hey, first pack magic guys, we got Radiant Charles, are not bad, and although it's a double, this one looks way better centered than the one I have for Corona. We'll take that, we'll take Radiant Charizard as our first hit, not too bad. I mean, I'm gonna spoil it, I guess I might as well, but the one thing I haven't pulled in any of these pack openings so far is a Galarian Gallery Pokemon. I haven't pulled any of the V-Stars for the special artworks yet. Nope. Will I pull one in this video today? I'm kind of doubting it to be honest. I am kind of doubting it. Kind of doubting it. Now, how can my not be that bad? I've, like, I've seen a lot of videos where they're just pulling them left and right. At least you get one at least per I'll say, collection box or the trainer box. But... I could be the outlier, Barrel nice, I need that one. The Barrel um, Galarian Gallery. And the Entei Holo, nice. Yeah, um... Come on, at least one, at least one. Come on, bless me with at least one Pokemon. V-Star, Galarian Gallery. Any. I just happy with, be happy with any darkness, fish shot, dig and duo, ultra ball, cycle. I don't want to spoil what I pulled in the Pokemon Center one, but I definitely didn't pull any V stars and nothing, nothing. All right, we're about halfway through. I think this is our fifth pack. If I can get it open, go. What I've noticed as well, editing, going through editing my videos sometimes when I pull out the, the stack of cards. I revealed the cold card, but luckily with this one, the cold cards are all the same, so you can't tell. Execute, Colossum, and we've got a Rotom Bean, nice, that's a, that's one that I need for the Master Set as well. I mean, not bad so far in terms of what I need for the Master Set. A couple of doubles, a couple of doubles, but... A couple of decent ones for the master set as well. Alright, so this is the six pack. Still no V star or no special artwork from this Leech in a box. To be honest, I'm not really expecting one. Energy search, run on. Requires a VMAX, nice, not bad. I'll take that. Yep, four packs left. Uh, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say that Radiant Charizard is gonna be the best hit from this box. Yeah, I'm gonna say that that Charizard is gonna be the best hit from this box. We only four packs remaining. We could talk Aaron, Yolu, Starly. Yes. Oh my days, yes. Beautiful artwork, definitely not not the best for me, but beautiful artwork. That is a really beautiful artwork. We finally pulled a V star. Well, a V, yeah, a V in the special artworks. Not berserker. Yes, finally, guys, I pulled a Pokemon from the special artworks. It's a V, not a V star, but still, I'll take it. So we've got, I think, three packs. This is the third to last pack. High five. Luxio, Electric, Fresh Carrier, Meow, Velma, Shinx, Lovista, Odish, Isurian Voltorb. Yes, I do need that one. I believe I do need that one. Nice. And a Hollow Bead signature. Again, a lot of high fives today. I've seen a lot of high five, en high five energies today, which, in some ways, is a good thing. In some ways, is a good thing. So far, it looks like it's not giving me the good luck. The high five energy, fire. I believe that's our first one. Seeing fire, maybe. Ponyard, Roma, Book, Fish, Odish, Ultra Ball, Heliolisk. Alright, guys, last pack. Are we gonna get last pack magic? Um, 
the day that you see this, I believe the Mini Tins and the Pikachu VMAX should be releasing. A video on those should be coming up soon as well, hopefully. And then after that, I don't know, I think it's the, the tins, uh, gift tins or bigger tins, what you call them. But I'll tell you, are we getting anything? I think nope. Alright guys, so what we got for a recap, this is from the Reggie E. Lecky box. We got Greedent V, Bidoof, Lucienna, Rayhan Full Art, Valerian Gallery, from Reggie Jago V, from Reggie Jago V Collection box, just a one Duraludon V, and this is from the Elite Trainer box. So we got Suri and Voltorb, finally pulled one of these, finally it took, I believe 50 plus packs, Luminium V, Requires a V Max, Rotom V, Hit Barrel, and a Radiant Charizard. Alright, guys, so that was the Reggie Lucky V Collection Box, Reggie Drago V Collection Box, and the Lee Trainer Box. If you enjoyed the video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate if you click the like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more, and I'll see you on the next one.